The classic movie Cats, 1969, directed by Ken Loach, left a deep impression on the audience with a touching story about the boy Billy and his beloved Falcon. But after more than half a century, have you ever wondered what the talented actors who brought those memorable moments are like now? Please join us in reviewing the golden faces of Cats and explore their lives and careers from then to now. You'll be surprised to see their changes and exciting journey throughout the years. Colin Wellen played Mr. Farthing, a dedicated teacher who cares about his students, always tries to help Billy. When filming in 1969, 35-year-old Colin Wellen brought authenticity and complexity to the character. After Cass, Colin continued his acting career and screenwriting career with many successes, including winning the Oscar for Best Original Screenplay for the film Chariots on Fire. Sadly, on November 2, 2015, Colin passed away at 81 due to Alzheimer's disease. He is remembered as a talented actor and screenwriter, leaving a deep impression in the hearts of audiences and colleagues. Weird about it when it's flying. Yeah, what's that box that best flies the race? No, I didn't mean that. I mean, when it's flying, there's something about it that makes you feel strange. Asked me to write it in the first place. Hugh Hudson for respecting me and my script, which is a very hard thing to find in our business, as you know. David Bradley played Billy Casper, a poor but energetic boy who finds joy and meaning in life while taking care of a falcon. When he was in the film in 1969, 60-year-old David Bradley brought authenticity and emotion to the character. After Cass, David continued his acting career with many roles in other films and TV shows such as Z Cars and The Flaxton Boys. Now at 70, David continues his acting career and has recently participated in many films and TV shows. He lives with his family and regularly participates in charity activities, especially programs to support children and protect animals. David is also an active participant in fan events and always maintains an optimistic spirit. And straight onto the globe, wham! And she'll grab me for me. Anyway, I pleased me saying I didn't know what to do. So I thought, well, I. Casper, make a little movie which nobody expected would do much business outside of Yorkshire, but yet here we are. Oh. Ducky Brown played Milkman, the milkman of Billy's neighborhood. When he was in the film in 1969, a 29-year-old Ducky Brown brought authenticity and humor to the character. After Cass, Ducky continued his acting and comedy career with many roles in other films and TV shows such as Coronation Street and The Comedians. Sadly, on August 16, 2022, Ducky passed away at the age of 82. He is remembered as a talented actor and comedian, leaving a deep mark in the hearts of audiences and colleagues. Ducky is also an active participant in charity activities and always maintains an optimistic spirit. Go pass on the kids' scooter. What? Well, I know what I always say. What? Third class riding is better than first class walking any day. You call that third class riding in that run, Shaq? got a photograph of her husband in bed with the chemist's wife. The chemist looked at him and said, why didn't you say you had a prescription? <laughs> Brian Clover played Mr. Sugden, a strict gym teacher and often bullies students. When he was in the film in 1969, 35-year-old Brian Clover brought authenticity and humor to the character. After Cass, Brian continued his acting career with many roles in other films and TV shows such as Porridge and Alien 3. Sadly, on July 24, 1997, he passed away 63 from a brain tumor. He is remembered as a talented actor and respected friend, leaving a deep impression in the hearts of audiences and colleagues. You're the captain. Right, line up on the halfway line quickly. I'll have first pick, Badgett. That's not fair, sir. You're going to have best players. Do you want to play football? I don't do some... Played like a team whose town was involved in free underwear. <laughs> and very lazy about that. Very lazy about that. Easily ripped apart. <laughs> Lynn Perry played Mrs. Casper, Billy and Chad's mother, a strong woman who often faces difficulties in life. When filming in 1969, 38-year-old Lynn Perry brought authenticity and pathos to the character. After Cass, Lynn continued her acting career with many roles in other films and TV shows, such as Queenie's Castle and Coronation Street. Sadly, on March 24, 2006, she passed away 74 due to old age. She is remembered as a talented actress and respected friend, leaving a deep impression in the hearts of audiences and colleagues. Why? I'm entertaining. <laughs> You're kidding. I'm entertaining as much as you also do, all right, Shanta? What trap you've been going out with lately, man? 
it takes a long time to shake off uh, things like that you drink. Mm. And um, I, I stopped drinking two months before. Bernard Ather plays Youth Employment Officer, a youth employment counselor who has little interest in Billy's future. When filming in 1969, 41-year-old Bernard Ather brought authenticity and complexity to the character. After cast, Bernard continued his acting career and political career, becoming an important figure in the Leeds community. He served as Lord Mayor of Leeds from 2000 to 2001 and was made for CBE for services to the arts and the community. Sadly, on October 22, 2022, Bernard passed away at 94 after a short illness. He is remembered as a talented actor and respected social activist, leaving a deep impression in the hearts of colleagues and audiences. Who knows what I thought about it, right? Well, you should be thinking about it. You want to start off on the right foot, don't you? Mm. ...document which will be useful in 20, 30 years' time when people find it difficult to recognize the way in which those people were living. Uh, there are people now... Built in place a fish and chip shop man who sells fish and chips in Billy's neighborhood. When he was in the film in 1969, 48-year-old Bill Dean brought authenticity and humor to the character. After cast, Bill continued his acting career with many roles in other films and TV shows such as Bookside and The Golden Vision. Sadly, on April 20, 2000, Bill passed away at 78 from a heart attack. He is remembered as a talented actor and respected friend, leaving a deep impression in the hearts of audiences and colleagues. Throughout his life, Bill was always an active social activist and loved by many people. Stop kicking, will you? We only put that on. You're actually uh, starting a film with Albert Finney back in 1972, Gumption. Oh, it's a long time ago. Mm. How much did you get paid for that one? Well, we got paid out in ducats. So. Freddie Fletcher played Chad, Billy's older brother, a rude and violent man who often bullies his younger brother. In 1969, 19-year-old Freddie Fletcher brought authenticity and complexity to the character. After cast, Freddy continued his acting career with many roles in other films and TV shows such as Queenie's Castle and Emmerdale Farm. Now at 74, he has retired and lives a peaceful life with his family. He regularly participates in community activities and is an active person in protecting the environment. He is also an art lover and often attends local art exhibitions. What's to know about falconry? Is it dear? <laughs> Falconer's handbook, where did I get this from? I've lent it. Nicked it more like. Where got it from? Shopping. Bob Bowes Mr. Christ, the principal, who is strict and often punishes the students. When he was in the film in 1969, 47-year-old Bob Bowes brought authenticity and complexity to the character. After cast, Bob did not continue his acting career but returned to teaching. He is the principal of a high school and is respected by many students and colleagues. Sadly, on December 1st, 1979, Bob passed away at 57 from illness. He is remembered as a talented teacher and actor, leaving a deep impression in the hearts of students and colleagues. And we'll laugh about the thrashings that I gave him. But what do I get from you lot? A honk from a greasy, pimply face. Julie Goodyear played woman in Betting Shop, a woman who frequently appears at the Betting Shop. When she was in the film in 1969, she was 27 years old and brought authenticity and complexity to the character. After cast, she continued her acting career with many roles in other films and TV shows such as Coronation Street. She is currently 82 and has been diagnosed with dementia. Now she is living with a family, receiving care and support from relatives. Because, you know, you are looked after, you know, you go to makeup, you go to, your clothes are there. You know, so uh, as soon as I got in work, I could turn into bed. Who is your favorite character in Cass? And what do you think when some actors have passed away? Leave your comments below this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe to the channel, and ring the bell to wait for my next videos. Thank you.